We recently completed the restoration of a 1969 Camaro called the ZR9, and to prepare it for its delivery, we contacted Eric Huber from DFT Details to put a finishing shine on this awesome car. Uh, today we're going to detail this beautiful uh, Camaro behind me. We're going to dress the tires, uh, clean the rims, uh, we're going to give it a nice coat of wax, uh, clean the glass, and see if there's any uh, imperfections in the paint we'll take a look at as well. Throughout the years I've been wrenching on cars and detailing cars. Started detailing when I was probably 12 or 13 years old. Now we detail 8,500 cars per year and some of the nicest, most collectible cars in the world. Um, and we, we travel the country uh, detailing at various events including every single Mecham Classic Car Auction, the Muscle Car and Corvette Nationals, the Festivals of Speed we just added to our repertoire now uh, down in Florida, various other ones as well. First thing you want to do is get the surface clean, so we went ahead and washed this car, uh, got every surface of it, we cleaned it from top to bottom, that way any dirt washes down and you're not going to scratch the paint as you clean it. When you dry a car, it's as important as, as when you wash it, uh, you want to start at the top and, and work your way down uh, and use something soft like a microfiber drying towel or a chamois. If you do use air, you want to use a rubber tip blow gun, that way if you, if you bump it against the paint it won't scratch. First step is we're going to spray the surface of the, the paint with our DFT detailer spray to remove any residue, uh, any water spots, and get it prepped for the wax. Uh, the detail spray, just to mist it on, wipe it off, a little goes a long way. Um, you can probably do 20 cars out of each bottle, so don't overuse. Uh, you just make more work for yourself. Uh, the detailer spray you could use in the sun. It's, it's recommended you do it in, when it's uh, cooler in the shade, but you can do it in the sun. Uh, you just have to work a little faster. DFT detail spray is safe for all paints, all finishes, from lacquers to base coat clear coats. It's also safe for chrome, paint, even glass. Next we'll use the DT DFT wet. Uh, we're going to go over all the paint with it, uh, apply it all, and then come back and wipe it off. Um, it is also safe for anything, if you get it on the chrome or, or the trim, it's not going to hurt anything, it won't dry it out. Uh, it's very, very easy to use. DFT Wet is a Carnuba polymer blend, so you kind of get the best of both worlds. Uh, it's very, very easy to use, very easy to take off, doesn't dry uh, to a, a hard film where if you, if you wait too long. Gives it a nice warm glow and a long-lasting protection. Carnuba is an, is an excellent uh, protectant. Um, it's been around for a long time. The problem with it, it's hard to use. It, it's, it's what chalks up, it's what turns white, and you have to do section by section. Polymers, on the other hand, are man-made, they're synthetic. Uh, they last a little bit longer um, and are easier to use. So we chose to combine them and we have what we believe is the optimum blend for ease of use and long-lasting protection. DFT Wet is very easy to use. I apply it in small overlapping circles. Uh, covering the surface. You can do the whole car all at once. It'll haze up just like any other wax. Usually takes five to ten minutes depending on the, the humidity and the temperature in the air and then simply go and wipe it off just like you would anything else. I like to use uh, our microfiber applicator pads. Uh, they are a sponge wrapped with a microfiber. Uh, it gives you a little absorption so you, you can your work goes longer uh, and the microfiber prevents any scratching. I like to use a, a premium microfiber towel when I'm taking the wax off. It doesn't scratch and it makes quick work of the wax. To care for a microfiber towel, you want to wash it without, with a detergent without any fabric softener or bleach in it. That will actually coat the fibers uh, and actually cause the towel to streak and not absorb like it should. Uh, also, do not use any dryer sheets. Uh, dry on a, on a low to medium heat setting, it, otherwise a hot setting will, will actually shrink the fibers and, and they won't last near as long. You can buy our towels in quantities of one, three, or ten. We're going to use our DFT Clean All on the tires to get rid of any oxidation or dirt that we missed when we were washing it. And then we're going to follow it up with the detailer on the, on the rims uh, to protect those and give them a nice shine. And then finally we're going to go over the tires again with the DFT Shield and give them a nice protection and a nice clean look. We're going to use the DFT Glass on the windows to go over it to get rid of any, any water spots or fingerprints and finish off the car. After the DFT treatment, the ZR9 looked as slick as glass. You can learn more about DFT products on their website at dftdetails.com and their products are available at v8gear.com.